Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this lesson, we're going to be learning about creating sample lines in Civil 3D. Let's get started. In this exercise, you'll create a set of sample lines along the alignment. The sample lines define the stations at which the cross sections are cut, also the width of the sections to the left and right of the alignment. A set of sample lines is stored in a sample line group for the alignment. Each sample line group has a unique name and each line within the group also has a unique name. So let's start creating sample lines. Go ahead and open up your sections-sample-lines-create drawing in your tutorials folder. Then go ahead and go into your home tab and then into profile and section views. Next, go ahead and select sample lines. Now our command line is asking us to select an alignment. Let's go ahead and press enter to select from a list. And we're going to select our center line. Go ahead and click OK. Now you see that the create sample line group dialog box is displayed. Now this dialog box defines the characteristics of the sample line group. The templates shipped with Autodesk Civil 3D contained predefined line styles and line label styles for the sample lines. Now in the top portion of the Create Sample Line Group dialog box, specify the following parameters. In the sample line style, we're going to go ahead and leave it on Road Sample Lines. And in the sample line label style, we're going to leave it at the default of name and section marks. Now, under the Select Data Sources to Sample, verify the sample checkboxes are selected for all the entries in the table. Data sources may include surfaces, corridor models, and corridor surfaces. Each surface and corridor surface results in a single cross-sectional string. Using the corridor model as a source includes all of the points, links, and shapes in the model. Now we're going to set the section styles to the following, but note you can double click within the styles cell in the table to select the section style. Let's start with the existing grade. We're going to select the style here, click the drop down, and click existing ground. Press OK, and then in corridor 1, we're going to select all codes and click OK. Now for the top, we're going to select Finish Grade. Click OK. And then for Datum, we're going to select Finish Grade. Click OK. And then click OK. Now you'll see that the Sample Line Tools toolbar is displayed and a specify station along baseline prompt is shown within our command line. On the toolbar, go ahead and select this drop-down. This is the Sample Line Creation Methods button. Select the option from Corridor Stations. This option creates a sample line at each station found in the corridor model. Now in the Create Sample Lines from Corridor Stations dialog box, Specify the following parameters. For the left swath width, we're going to specify 150. And then for the right, we're going to specify the same. Now click OK. Now you'll see that the sample lines are now created and the toolbar is still available for defining additional lines if desired. Let's go ahead and close this toolbar. So that's how you go about creating sample lines in Civil 3D. If you'd like to learn more about Civil 3D workflow tips and tricks, visit AutoCADCivil3DTraining.com and be sure to sign up for future video notifications or click subscribe on our YouTube channel. Again, 
My name is Charles Ellison. Take care.